en la calle, en la yes. calle también con yes. <risa> Ok. El next, you. Okay. Ask me. Did, did, you, huh? did you eat a lot of candies? Yes, I didn't. In school, my house. En esa parte recuerdo. Okay. Yes, I did. Okay. <laughs> ah, yes, I did. Le dije también. Next. Did you, did you like going to school? Yes, I did. Did you get good grades at the school? Buenas notas, good grades. Yes, I did. You were a good student. Yes. Okay, nice. Um, me. Did you? Oh, yo le pregunto. <laughs> Did you have? Aquí yo yo tenía 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 duda. Hi teacher. Esa Hi, tenía teacher. duda yo. Teacher, have a question of yesterday. And cuando se utiliza el did, did you? ¿Por qué a veces ¿Qué pasa, pasa? Eh, el verbo para de de, de pasado a, a a verbo base? Por ejemplo, yes, I did. I went to the meeting. Esta sería la respuesta de la pregunta. Eh, did you go to the meeting? Uh -huh. Pero ahí, 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 ¿por qué lo pasó al pasado, teacher? La respuesta. Sí, sí, sí. Sí, porque está hablando en afirmativo. En pasado, uh -huh. ajá, solo, ajá. solo cuando usamos el auxiliar did or didn't in, a, in questions in negative form, the verb is going to be in base form. Okay. But yeah, yeah, in affirmative, you have to use the past form. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sí, que tenía esa duda ayer que estaba haciendo la tarea en la noche que lo teníamos que pasar a, a, a... porque lo volvíamos a la, su forma base ajá es... porque no pueden ir dos dos no pueden ir dos verbos pasados ajá no se lo utilizamos para para como auxiliar auxiliar ajá, tenía yo esa duda ok Okay. Did you eat a lot, a lot of candies? Yeah, chocolate. I like <laughs> chocolate of, of milk. My my brother, uh, ¿cómo se dice cultivar, teacher? Grow. 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 Ah, como casi grown, como tierra. Grow. Grow. Como grow. crecer, crecer. Grow. Mm, grow. Uh, okay. uh, my brother grow uh, cacao. Uh, Yo ni lo conocía. El fin de semana pasado lo conocí. <laughs> yeah. He grow uh, cacao to Hershey. Mm. And have to estanque, no sé cómo le dicen los herborios. With Hello, Jasmine. I want to hear you talking about your childhood. No, le. I want to hear you talking about your childhood. No, le entendí. It's okay. I want to hear, listen to you. Talking escuchar. about your childhood. Ah, quiere escuchar. Ok, de nuevo. 
Did you play marbles when you were a kid? Yes, I did. Did you play with your neighbors or with your siblings? Yes, I did. Arranca cebolla y mica. Um, I played, I played the full the onion. Así se llama arranca cebolla. Full the onion. Full the onion. Yes, full the onion. Ajá. Espérame, lo voy a poner ahí en el chat. Full the onion. Arranca cebollas. En mica, in English, is tag. Play tag. Uh -huh. eh, my favorite game when I was um, little was, uh, it was high and seek. Condelero, es condelero. High and sick. That was my favorite game. High and sick. That was my favorite game. And I didn't eat a lot of candies, but I loved eating choco bananas. Mm -hmm. And I still love choco bananas. I'm a choco bananas lover. I love, quiero ver. Eh, manzanas con caramelo, ¿cómo sería? Mm, caramel Eso, apples. Caramel apples. Ajá. Okay. Sí. Caramelized apples. Ok. ¿Y tú, Mr. Rodríguez? Uh, my favorite candy was the cerecitas. Oh, the cherries, the, the, the sweet cherries. Pero no las de bote, sino las de... de las de, la de feria. Las de feria. No serían cerecitas, se llama manzanilla. Una no, 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 no. No, las cerecitas de, de Diana. From Diana, ajá. Uh -huh. Diana es... Ah, pues sí, son cerecitas. Pensé que eran de feria, eran las manzanillas, unas rojitas. Little cherries, little cherries. Ah. Ok. Pero de feria me gusta la cocada. Cocada. Coconut. Candy coconut. The sweet coconut. Hey, did you, which TV programs did you watch when you were little? What TV programs did you watch? Messenger Z. Messenger Zita, okay, or Zita. Yeah, my, my brother, Dragon Ball, okay. Dragon Ball Z, the Flintstones, yes, the Flintstones, they are nice. También los Supersonic, the Supersonic. The Supersonic. Uh -huh. El Chavo del Ocho. Chavo de los... Chavo, yes, that is a nice one. Well, since I think I am younger than you, I I I liked watching Nickelodeon. Yes. Nickelodeon, yes. For example, I I watched, I watched TV uh, the Saturday in the morning. Club de los Triguitos, de los Triguitos. Oh, yes, I remember that one. <laughs> I also remember la, El Jardín de la Tía Bubu on, on Sunday's morning. También era este, el... El Jardín Infantil, este me acuerdo yo. Es que yeah. también, primero fue Jardín Infantil y después hicieron el de la tía Bubu. Oh. <risa> ya me sentí viejo. Y antes... Yo solo me acordaba de Jardín Infantil. Y antes de Jardín Infantil, creo que era el, el, el show del tío Memo, algo así. Oh. Eso sí, no recuerdo. And how old are you, Alfredo? Sorry, teacher. How old are you? 34. 34. Yeah, like my brother. My brother is, yeah, he is going to be 34 next week. Yeah. So you're like my brother. <laughs> okay, guys, did you have an imaginary friend? Yes, I did. 
No, I didn't. I have. Oh, I don't remember. You tell me. No, no. Sure. I didn't. <laughs> Okay. Jugar con las muñecas era jugar como con alguien imaginario porque no tenías, o con los peluches, no tenías con quién jugar. Es que yo jugaba con mi hermana, tiene un Play. año menos que mí. With my sister, I played with my sister. I played with my sister. Oh, okay, there, there was not a big difference between you and your sister, one year only. Did you like vegetables when you were kids? Yes, I did. Este, compresión psicológica de un cincho. Yes, I did. With the belt. I remember that when I was a kid, I didn't like papaya. That is not a vegetable, it's a fruit, but I didn't like it because for me, the smell. I didn't like the smell. But now it's one of my favorite fruits. It's one of my favorite fruits. Can you imagine that? Mm -hmm. Very interesting. I didn't like chicken soup either. I don't know why, but I didn't like the chicken soup. But now I like it. So it's like the change, right? Okay, guys, good. Ask Mauricio, please. Uh, did you participate? Hello, guys. Did you already practice? Did you already Hello, practice? Teacher. Hello, Salvador. Um, es que fíjese que se han salido las dos personas que no estaban de oyente. Mm -hmm. Oh, so you have not practiced. Hello, Marlon. Marlon wrote hello. Okay, Salvador. I'm going to ask you some questions, Salvador. Mm, did you play, did you play tag or mica when you were a kid? Um, repeat, please, teacher. Did you play mica or tag when you were a little? Um, Mika, teacher. You, I played tag. Se dice tag. Tag. I tag. Okay, I played tag. 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 I, tag. Uh -huh. T A G. I wrote it in the chat. Okay. okay. Um, did you did you like uh, candies when you were little? Did you eat a lot of candies? Uh, no, I didn't, teacher. Oh, me neither. <laughs> High five. Yeah, I, I didn't like candies that much, but I remember that I liked eating a lot of choco bananas. Yeah, I ate one choco banana every afternoon. Almost oh, mm -hmm. every day. <laughs> Yeah. Mm, did you participate in a school events when you were little? Teacher, es que bien cortado, le escucho, fíjense. No sé si me escucha como usted. Yo, yo sí le escucho bien. Y ahora me escucha mejor. Hola. Hola, no me escucha. Es que en algunas le escucho cortado, fíjense. Hola, ¿me escucha? Hola, teacher. ¿Ahora sí me escucha? Sí, le escucho un poco mejor, solo que a veces se, 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 como que se corta. Ah, no sé si es el internet. Vamos a ver. Sí. Voy a intentar.
Teacher, aprovecho, aprovecho ahorita que están, este, que, que tengo tiempo. Este, ¿será que me puedo retirar este, unos minutos antes ahora? Hmm. It depends. <laughs> ok, Yasmin, it's ok. Sí, es que tengo que ir a hacer una, a recoger a una persona y eh, para no irme tan noche. Hmm. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, pero me, ya me van a confirmar a la, a la hora si, si me tengo que ir a las nueve y media o, o si siempre salgo a las diez. Ok. Ok, guys. Ok. <laughs> Don't worry. Ok, guys. Can you tell me about your childhood? Who would like to share with the class? We was remember the childhood. We remembered our childhood. Okay. What what did you remember about your childhood? I was playing trompo. I played trompo. I played trompo. I played the trompo. Chibola, ¿cómo se dice? Marbles. Marble. Marbles. Mm -hmm. Marble. Mika. Tag. Uh -huh. You tag. play tag. Yeah. Tricky track. That's okay. Salvador <laughs> played the soccer with his friends. Yo-yo. How do you say yo-yo? Yo-yo. 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 With light and not light. <laughs> but... I remember that. Oh. Salta, yeah. salta cuerda no cuajo Jump the rope. Jump, Jump the rope. rope. Uh -huh. Jump the rope. Jump yeah. the rope. Uh -huh. Jump the rope. Tag. Ni salta cuerda. Pelegrina. Pilgrim. <laughs> Jack. Jack. Mm -hmm. I like to play board games. For example, no te enojes. Board games. Also one. The one game. Monopoly. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Tuskia. <laughs> Nunca jugó Tuskia. <laughs> yes, I did. I did. Y Zancadilla. Uy. Pero bueno. Pero juego violentos. <laughs> When I was little, my favorite game was hide and seek. Arranca cebolla, teacher. Pull the onion. Pull the onion. Yes. Also the flowers or the plants, las plantas, the plants and the colors. En Chan Chavalán, Chaujitas de Laurel, me dicho la señora que sí. Yes, it was, I mean, I mean, those were like fantastic. Esa canción en inglés, ¿cómo sonaría, Chan I don't know. Una vez la oí en inglés. Really? Pero ya no me acuerdo cómo se dice. Really? I have never heard it in English and I would like to. I'm going to look for it. Maybe I can find it. Okay, guys. Voy a buscar so, internet. Yes, yes. I'm glad that you were talking about your childhood, okay? And also at the same time, you were practicing the past tense, just no questions in simple past. Okay, so now let's go and learn about information questions in simple past. This is very simple. It's very, very similar to, or it's almost the same structure as yes, no questions. The only difference is that I have to add the question word, WH question word at the beginning. Okay, but uh, to talk, to get into that topic here, I will show you uh, this, this slide about an email. This email. Oops. I think I had this problem. 
Okay, this email is about a customer's problem. The subject of the email is complaint about a tree. It says, last week I had a chance to travel with your company to another country. But to be honest with you, it was a bad experience because the bus that you assigned me in didn't have AC or air conditioner. It was a long trip and the bus was very slow. I am considering not traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I had. Wow. So the client or the customer is not happy with the service, is not satisfied. Now I'm gonna ask Mr. Alexander Gonzalez, Mr. Domingo, to read the to read the email. Can you read the email, please, Mr. Domingo Gonzalez? To no, only, Peter, only the, the message, okay? Last week. Last week. Last week I have the chance to travel with your company or another country. But to be honest with you, with is you. what is with you, it was a bad experience. experience experience because, experience because the boss that that you a cynic me I me in my Indian hack I see a is, AC, okay it was a love trip and the boss was very slow solid I am, I am considering not traveling, traveling with you angry because of the inconvenience, inconvenience I have. Inconvenience I have. Okay, thank you, Mr. Inconvenience I have. Inconvenience, yes. Now I'm going to ask. Mauricio Mahano, can you please read the message? Uh, last week, I have the change to travel with your company to another country. But to be honest with you, it was a bad experience because the boost that you assigned, assigned me in Signing me in ding ding didn't have, have AC. It was a long trip and the bus was very slow. I am considering not traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I have. Thank you, Mr. Mahano. Okay, now that we have read this message three times, you have to answer the questions, okay? What is the question number one, Alba? Read. Read the question, please. One, what did they pass over walk? Two, why did the passenger consider it a bad experience at some pro? Three, what did the passenger send that email? Okay, so question number one, where did the passenger go? Where did the passenger go? Another, Another country. country. The passenger, the passenger went. Passenger. The person went, another went country. to another country. Very good. Okay, second question. Why did the passenger consider it a bad experience? Because the bus didn't have air conditioning. The bus didn't have air conditioning. And, and it was? 
the bus the was bus very, slow. Slow. very slow. Very slow. Okay, nice. Number three. Okay, the number three. What did the passenger send that email? Okay, yo creo que aquí hay un error del libro. Sería, why, por qué el pasajero envió ese correo? Why did the passenger send that email? Because he did considering, Because he is considering, considered not traveling again. Okay. Traveling there again. Traveling with them again. Okay. Yeah, he sends that email like to complain about the service. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to complain about the service. Que harse el servicio, right? To complain about the service and giving a reason why he is not going to uh, travel with them, right? Very good. Okay, guys, now let's see the structure. Information questions. We have these examples. Vamos a ver quién las lee. Carlo Alberto, can you please read the questions? Okay. Information question. What do you buy? Where did he fly to? When did we pay for the service? How did they find out of that promotion? Thank you so much. Okay, so as you can see in this example, we have information question, word, the question word, the, the auxiliary deed, subject, and then the verb in base form. What did you buy? I bought a vacation package. Where did he fly to? He flew to another country. When did we pay for the service? We paid for the service last month. How did they find out that promotion? They found out about it on internet. Okay, como ven, in information questions require a information in the answer. O sea que para responder una de estas hay que dar la información, porque eso es lo que está preguntando. No, no pregunta sí o no, no, eso lo vimos ayer, sino que es información. Por ejemplo, what did you buy? ¿Qué compró? Ah, compró un paquete de vacaciones. Where did he fly to? ¿A dónde voló? ¿O a dónde viajó, verdad? Viajó a otro país. When did we pay the for the service? When did we pay, for the we pay a half for the service last month. ¿Cuándo pagamos por el servicio? Pagamos el mes pasado. How did they find out that promotion? ¿Cómo se dieron cuenta? Find out es eso, darse cuenta de. How did they find out of that, of that promotion? They found out about it on internet. Okay. Vamos a ver. Now here, I have this chart for you to help you. So in this past simple, it's very simple. You ju we just have the question word. The question word can be who, what, when, where, why, and how. Then the next part is the auxiliary deed. Then we have the subject. It's the same for every, every subject. I, you, he, she, it, you, or we. And then the verb in the base form. For example, go, do, see, play, fight, tell, and read. Can you help me to write some of the questions using these, these prompts? Hagamos algunas preguntas aquí, ¿verdad? Para hacer, for example, who, who uh -huh. did he report? ¿A quién le reportó? Who did he report to? Okay. 
What? What do you? What do you fight? Mm. Okay. Oh, what did you? Tell? What did you tell the bank? What do you do? ¿Qué le dijo al jefe? What did you tell the boss? When? When did you send the email? Where? Where did, Where did you buy? Uh -huh, you buy the products. You buy for this. Come on, teacher. <laughs> I'm sorry. Where did you buy the products and why? Why did you get to refund? What did you buy? Them? Why did you okay. get them? How? How did you find out? Share. Where did you? Mm, I don't understand what you said. How did, How you... did you? How did you get to work? Como llegó a su trabajo? By car, by bus, walking, etc. So as you can see, we have who plus the auxiliary subject and then the verb. Y yes. si quería poner cómo hizo para pagar algo. How did you How pay? Did How did you pay? You? How did you pay for it? Okay. How did you pay? I pay with bitcoins. Uh -huh. How do you pay for it? For it. Okay, para pagarlo. Mm -hmm. Very good. Exercises. Okay, in these exercises, you have y to para tell decir, me. Y para decir cómo lo hizo sería, how did you do it? Exactly, very good. How do you do it? Excellent. Okay, guys, now in these uh, conversations, you have to tell me, um, what is the correct question word for each conversation, okay? And conversation one, did you do yesterday? I went shopping. So what is the correct, what? Did where, you do yesterday? Where did you do yesterday? Or who did you do yesterday? Where did where? you do yesterday? Where did you? Veamos. I where did you... read, the, read the answer. The answer is going to give you a clue for you to know what is the, uh, the correct question word according to this, the, the, the information. Do do? What do you do yesterday? Exactly. What do you do? What, what do you do, do yesterday? Do okay. Uh, okay, number two. Uh, did you get to San Francisco? We traveled by bus. How do you How get to San Francisco? Exactly. How do oh. you get to San Francisco? Oh. Number three. All were you last year? I was 23. How old were you last year? Exactly. How old? Yeah. Okay, number four. What was that noise? Mm -hmm. What was that noise? What were they? It, it was just the wind. It was just the wind. Number five. What was? Where were they? Where were they? Exactly. 
They were at the library. Number six, did you have lunch? We had lunch at noon. When did you have when lunch? When did you have lunch? When did you have lunch? Okay, number seven. Was your teacher? Mrs. Jones was my teacher. Who was your teacher? Who was your teacher? Who was your teacher? And the last one. Why? Why? Why were you late? Why were you late? Exactly. Why were you late? Oh, Miss the bus. Very good. Congratulations, guys. But it doesn't finish here. You still have more exercises. Aha. Uh -huh. Number nine. Ate the cake. A steward ate it. Who ate the cake? Who ate the cake? Who ate the cake? He's the comer pastel. Estuvo. La rayita roja. Yes, I'm looking for it. Okay, number 10. Who? Who was? Why? Why was, was that, that on the phone? Uh -huh. Who was that on the phone? ¿Quién era el del ¿Quién era el que estaba en el teléfono? It was Steven. Did she say? She said goodbye. What did, what, what did, did she, she say? say? What did she say? Number 12. Did they graduate? When? They when? Graduate? When? when? When did, did they graduate? graduate? Okay. And the last one. Time did you go to bed? I went to bed. What time did you go to bed? When? What time? What time? What time? Okay. Said did you go to bed? Excellent. Congratulations. Very good. Oops, no atrás. Okay, now in this other exercise, this is what you are going to do. You read the answers and you have to complete the questions, okay? And it's easy because, for example, Sam washed the car. Why did Sam wash the car? They ate dinner. Where did they, where did, where did it? Who? Where, they... Where did they eat the dinner? Mm -hmm. I saw my friend. Who did you see? I can be on. Who did you see? Okay, guys, so you have to work on these exercises, okay? In your notebook, and also, if you want, you can share in the chat. They ate you. Where the... They eat the dinner. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Uy, Vaya, me Matías. Me comí Vaya, el Matías. subject. Sí, pero el verbo no tiene que estar en pasado cuando usamos, cuando hacemos preguntas, usamos el auxiliar did y entonces el verbo va a estar en su forma base. Where did they eat dinner? Telephone. 
Give me one moment, guys, please. Ese, ese, ese del verbo ya sabía, teacher. Fue error de dedo. I'm sorry? Sí, ya sabía eh, lo, de, lo, de, lo del verbo. Mm. Pero mm. me comí el date. This. <laughs> okay, I'll be right back. Just give me one second. I need, I need to go for something. When did it? Vinora se comió. Oh, no, 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 no. Yo me estaba. When did it? ¿Cuántos son el teléfono? They come to school by bus. Ellos vienen a la escuela en el bus. <coughs> How did you come to school? Miss, Mrs. Brown bought a new coat. What she, what did she buy? Siete. The party started at three o'clock. When? When? Carlos Walberto. When did you start? Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. Write the questions. When did you start the party? I saw a ghost. Lo, lo estoy viendo, muchachos. <laughs> Ok, so, vaya, hagamos las preguntas. Pues. Veo que no las han puesto en el chat, pero. ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo no? No, no todas. Qué exigente estoy. <risa> <risa> Ah, vaya, no quieren que. que... No, Sorry. Domingo, eh. Mm. Ah, hoy sí. Ah, o quizás no me habían caído a mí. Porque no, no me habían caído. Ah, sí, no me habían caído, lo siento, chicos. Ya vi que, que los mandaron a las 8 y 55. Who did see my friend? Who did you see your friend? No, ¿cómo sería? Who did I saw see my, my friend. friend? Who did you see? No, ¿a quién vio? No, who ¿Quién did vio? see my friend? La pregunta es, ¿a quién vio? Who did you see? I saw my friend. ¿A quién viste? Vi a mi amigo. Mm. Vamos a ver otra Entonces sería, who did you see? Hmm. Vaya, la sí. otra, how did they come to school? Solo sería, how did they come to school? No, how did they come to school by bus? Porque by bus is the answer. He read a magazine. What the... Vamos a ver. Vamos a poner acá que ustedes comparan su respuesta.
Mr. Cañengues, Mr. Cañengues. Hi, teacher. I finish. Hmm, that's great. Que siempre escuchamos que hace ese ruidito. Es que es un tic nervioso, teacher. Sí, yo sé, anxiety, anxiety. I, have, I get a nervous. You get nervous. Okay, where they, they ate dinner? Sería la, la pregunta, entonces sería, where? Did they eat the dinner? Ajá, uh -huh, where did they eat dinner? Uh, I saw dinner. my friend. Only dinner. Uh -huh. Solo eso. Where did they eat dinner? Dinner. Number three. I saw my friend. Who did you see? I saw my friend. Okay. Uh, number four, the telephone ran. When, when did, did when did the telephone? Uh -huh. What is the 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 present of run? Ring. Ring. ring, exactly. Ring, ring. When did the telephone ring? Number five, they came to school by bus. The question is, how? How did come to a school? Did they? Okay. How did they? Did um, to school. Mrs. Okay. Brown, Mrs. Brown bought a new car. What did she buy? What did she buy? Excellent. Number seven, the party started at three o'clock. When did it start? When did the party start? When did the party start? No, it's a start the party, teacher. No, primero. Y el sujeto. El, su, el, su, el sujeto no aparece ahí. When party, 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 party. Subject. Okay, number eight. I saw a ghost. Where? Where did you see? It. ¿Dónde lo viste? Where did you see mm. it? ¿Dónde lo viste? Cemetery. I saw it in the cemetery. Okay, but ghosts do not exist. <laughs> okay, uh, number eight. Why did go? Why did she go? Why did she go? Why did she go, why, why did why she go? Did she go home? Mm -hmm. Why did she exactly? Go home? ¿Por qué se fue para la casa? Why did she go home? He read a magazine. What? Did he read? Why? What? Did? Did he read? Did he read? Very good. Excellent.
Okay. Any teacher, questions? Teacher, uh, lista, teacher. <gasps> yes, I'm sorry. I just forgot it. Thank you for reminding me. Okay, let's stop for one moment. Teacher, you are sleeping. Yeah, I forgot. Okay, me estoy durmiendo en las laureles. Ajá, just kidding. Alba de Noravides. Laureles, I don't know. Alba Vides. Present. Alfredo Rodas. Present. Amir Carcañengues. Present. Carlos Gualberto. Present. Cristina Romero. She's absent, yes. Domingo Alexander. Present. Fátima Portillo. Present. Matías Lemus. I'm here. Marco Velázquez. Present teacher. Marlon Cardona. Mauricio Alexander. Present. Maideligri. Nancy Lice Rodríguez. Rocío Martínez. Present teacher. Salvador Escobar. Present teacher. Hasta me asustó. <risa> Sandra Velázquez. Like to Agaster. Sandra Velázquez. Víctor Salazar. Walter Daniel González Pérez. William Eduardo Pérez. Jasmine Melanie Pérez. No, Pérez. Jasmine Melanie Lemus, I'm sorry. De verdad que ya estoy ya viendo otros números. Otros nombres. Otros apellidos, no, Betiche, estamos mal. Ya números, en vez de apellidos. No, es que como aquí veo números, en serio, aquí hay números. ¿De cuántos minutos están conectados? Ya ven cómo me tienen ya. Yesterday only 10 minutes. Me. Ah, you were just, yeah. You, you have to work. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, now guys, let's talk about our last vacation or trip. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? Okay, ahí tenemos el inicio. Van a preguntar, you're going to create questions. For example, what did you do on your last vacation? And you, you're gonna say, oh, my last vacation, I went to visit some friends. Oh, I went to the beach. How do you go to the beach? Oh, I went to the beach by bus, okay? Why did you go by bus? Oh, because I didn't have enough money for the, for the gasoline, okay? Where did you go? And who did you go with you? ¿Con quién fuiste? Entonces, los voy a poner en las salitas. Creamos las preguntas y le damos respuesta. Primero creamos las preguntas, nos ayudamos unos con otros. We help each other. And then, um, you interview your partner about your last vacation or trip. Por ejemplo, Amilcar y Matías son compañeritos. Entonces, primero crean las preguntas, se ayudan. They help each other to create the questions. But later on, they interview each other. Mr. Cañengues ask Matías, right? Matías, what did you do on your last vacation or on your last trip? Entonces, Matías answers and Mr. Cañengues writes the answer, writes the answer that Matías gives him, okay? Entonces usted escribe okay. la respuesta que le da a su compañero. Ready? Okay, ready. Good. Go ahead.
preguntarle. Espérenme, mi amor. Fátima. Ya la llevo. Yeah. Let's talk about our last vacation or trip is Fatima. Uh, I didn't have trip since two years <laughs> due to pandemia. <laughs> Due to the pandemic. Okay, but let's talk about two years ago before the pandemic. Oh, what was your time. last trip? Hmm. Let me think. Okay, refresh your memory. Refresh your memory. Yes, Rocio, I understand. We have to talk about our last vacation or trip. So I can I can talk about my last vacation that was uh, last year on December. Exactly. And I I I, I didn't travel to another country, but I traveled to to another city. Okay. Mm, I I went with my family to the ¿Cómo se dice la ruta de las flores? Teacher? The flowers route. Uh, the, to the flowers route. We went to to know the different place, the different famous place in El Salvador. Okay. We went to to eat uh, gastronomic food. The gastronomy, mm -hmm. the food. The gastronomic food, yeah. We also go to visit some church. Some churches. Mm -hmm. Churches. Um, and in some, some days, I stay at home and I we watch we watch movies with my I watch movie with my son and my daughter and also I went to I went for shopping. Okay. <laughs> and I think that's that was the most important thing that I did in my last vacation teacher. Okay, um, good. You have to also continue asking the other questions. You create the questions first. Okay. Then you ask. That's good. Thank you. You work. La... Ahorita lo va a notar, ¿verdad? Sí, ya lo noté. ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo hice el viaje? Seguro. ¿Cómo hizo? How did you get there? ¿Cómo llegó allí? Ah, con... <laughs> oh, how did you travel? How did you get there? How did you travel? Mm -hmm. Okay. How did you feel? How did you feel? Eh, en el anterior pusimos que viajamos a, a I did travel the beach. I, I did travel in the Ruta Panorámica. Entonces podemos poner la otra, how, how do you travel? Mm -hmm. How do you feel? Dejemos mejor. 
How do you feel? Ok. Están haciendo las preguntas ahorita. Sí. Uh -huh. Ok. Estamos uh, haciéndolas de una sola vez y contestando la respuesta de ella y la mía. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok, Alba, how do you feel? How did you feel? Y cuando ah. responden, ¿cómo responden? Perdón, que yo creo que escuché algo por ahí. Uh, contestamos, yes, I did. No sé si está mal. Yes, I did. Ah, oh. ok. En estas son preguntas de información, information questions. Oh, Entonces, la respuesta no es yes y no es no, porque está preguntando por información. Entonces, por ejemplo, se le pregunta, where did you go? ¿A dónde fuiste? Yes, I did. No. Cuando eh, yes, I did, está incorrecto, okay. ¿verdad? Porque le pregunta, ¿dónde fue? Sí, yo fui. No, ¿verdad? ¿A dónde fue? Where did you go? I went to Cerro Verde. Tiene que, la respuesta es información. Ok. Teacher, este también, yo había puesto, I did travel de, eh, de ruta panorámica. I traveled to Ruta Panorámica or Panoramic Route. I traveled. I traveled in the beach. I went to the beach. I went to the beach or I traveled to the beach. Okay. O sea que el did no va allí entonces. No, el did solo va para preguntar y didn't en negativo. Pero en afirmativo no, solo en las respuestas cortas, ¿verdad? Yes, I did, no, I didn't. Ok. 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 Hello, guys. Did you finish the questions? Did you discuss them? Sure. I have a question. Which, yes, Mr. Uh, why, why did you uh, le sigue el do o, o, o le puede poner uno el, el verbo de una vez? El verbo. And then number three. Sí, no, no importa en cualquiera de las preguntas. Okay. What did you? Y luego va el verbo. What did you do? Okay. How did you get there? How did you feel? Why did you go there? Why did you travel? Etc. Where did you go? For example, what did you do? Visit your parents? Mm -mm. No. Or, no or, or what did you visit your parents? ¿Qué? ¿Cómo quiere formular la pregunta? ¿Por qué visitaste tus padres ah. o parientes? Ok, ok. Why? Why? Ajá, es que yo le, yo le escuchaba what. Ok, no, what? Right. Why did you visit your parents? Ajá, ¿por qué visitaste uh -huh. a tus Why? padres? Why did you visit your parents? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What did you visit? Why did you visit your parents? Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Carlos. Uh -huh. Ready. <laughs> I'm start. Okay. And... What did you eat in the last vacation? I went swimming in the pool. Lake? Fui a nadar en la piscina, no? In piscina, no. Mm -hmm. Okay. I went swimming in the pool. Sería he. No. No, yo, sé, yo sé, acuérdate que yo voy a poner tu respuesta. Entonces mm -hmm. sería he. he. 
Or swim. Marco swimming in the pool. Went swimming. Or Marcos went. went Marco went in went Marcos swimming. In went pool. swimming in the pool. Swimming. Swimming in the pool. Went swimming in the went pool. Swimming. Marcos went swimming in the pool. In the pool. Poo. Poo. How do you spell poo? Poo. P O O L. Okay. My answer is uh, I I went mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I went vis visiting uh, my one mother oh, and, really? and my old son. Mm -hmm. Grandmother mm -hmm. e? Uh, my old son. Old son. Hijo mayor. Hijo mayor. Uh -huh. Old son. Uh -huh. Okay. How did how, how did you do to travel on vacation? Free, free autobus. I went, he went. Bus. I went the bus. The bus. I went the bus. Mm -hmm. the bus. Okay, es, en la mía sería I went drive in my motorcycle. Drive it in motorcycle. Sí. In. Vos tenés que poner in. He. He drive, he drive in motorcycle. He. Yo, he or, or, or Matia drive it in motorcycle. Mm, okay. Where did you come back so fast from vacation? Porque se me terminó el dinero. Okay, that is, good, that is a valid reason. <laughs> okay, guys, very good. I'm glad that you are practicing and helping each other, okay? Because because my money ran out. I ran out of money. I ran out of money. I ran out of money. Okay, it's in peace. I ran out of money. I did. I did. I did take a bus. Tomé el bus. I el autobús. A bus. Y no puedo decir I did take. Ah, uh, teacher, ¿puedo o no puedo? Bueno, sí se puede, pero es como para dar énfasis a lo que usted va a decir. Y ahí o normalmente sea... no, normalmente decimos I took the bus. Mi respuesta es en pasado simple o simple I took, past. I took a bus. Uh -huh. Mm, sí, o sea, por lo general no se contesta con el ID. Es que ese era para las yes no questions. Para las information questions, la respuesta es información. Usted está preguntando qué, cómo, cuándo, dónde, por qué. Ok. Wow. Entonces la respuesta es eso, el lugar... El, la hora, el día, la persona, la razón, el cómo. Ajá. 
entiendo. Y, y el cómo aquí sería ITK. No, o sea, es que aquí en la respuesta no debimos usar el did este domingo, sino que debimos haber dado una respuesta ya con la información en, en curso. Por ejemplo, uh -huh. how did you get to the beach? ¿Cómo llegaste a la, a la, a la playa? Right. Sería, I drove a car. Exactly, I drove a car. Ya no, ya no vamos a decir, I did drive. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ya entendí. Sí, I drove a car. Usar el pasado. Conduje un vehículo, llegué en un carro, algo así. Mm -hmm. Teacher. Great. For example, in this in the in this answer, why did you go to the beach? Why did you go to the beach? Mm -hmm. Okay, because I didn't have time to go. Before, uh huh. Before, before, where? Antes, porque no había no tenía tiempo antes. Mm -hmm. To go before. Al final, the finally. I didn't have time to go before. Mm -hmm. At the end. Ah, okay. Before. Thank you very much. You finished. are welcome. You're finished. Okay, nice. Nice. Teacher. Yes. Uh, say me. Tell if, me. Tell me. Tell me. Okay. Tell me if you if you think the answer the the question to correct or to correct um, uh, the question. How did you know about our company? Mm -hmm. Yes, it's correct. How did you know about the company? Mm -hmm. It's correct. Porque, porque, porque como también dijo usted que find out significa darse cuenta. Exacto. Puedo también decir, how did you find out? Uh -huh. Find out. Ok. How did you find out? Excellent. Ok, guys, I would like a couple of students to present in front of the class the questions, ok? Ask and answer the questions and present the interview. The interview. Okay, do we have a couple of students? Volunteers or victims? Victims. Victims. <laughs> no, I don't want to be like that. I want you to volunteer yourself. Victims. Teacher, lo que puede hacer es que escoja uno y ese que al que escoja, que escoja otro y así. Amilcar, and I choose Matías. Una, una pregunta nada más, teacher. Ok, Yasmin, tell me. Ok. Alba, por ahí. Ah, ok. You and Un Alba. Tier. Este, pero una pregunta, una pregunta nada más y así le damos chance a otro. Oh, nice, I like that idea. You choose the next one. Ok, what did you last vacation? What did you do on your last vacation? What did you 
do? What did you do on your last vacation? I went to the beach. And you? I I travel in the in the panoramic room. Wow. You traveled in the panoramic. Okay, congratulations. Good job. Okay, next. Who are the next, Jasmine? Milka. <laughs> Who? Amilka. Okay. okay. I am a You are one of okay. the Okay, uh, Domingo. Hi, You're Domingo. Here. Okay. How did you get to the beach? Mm -hmm. Domingo, no has encendí el micrófono, papá. Domingo va llegando a lunes. No voy a hacer las preguntas primero. Por eso, eso ya te, te hizo. Te hizo. Ok, How dale otra vez, repite. Repite, please. How did you get to the beach? Ah, I drove a car. Ok. Only one question. Oh, did you? ¿Cómo fue la pregunta? Okay. Um, Domingo or Amilka, choose another person, please. Matias. Yes, I'm here. And your payers. And your okay. partner. Partner, okay. Uh, Marco. Yeah. Uh, where did you go on vacation? I went. Oh. Espérame que me perdí. La cuatro. Mm, no, pero. Creo La que tres. Ya... No, okay, no pregunta, where, pregunta. where did you. No, porque cualquier pregunta ahí no. no, no. Okay. Solo uno. Where did you go on vacation? Um, I went visit to. Es que dice, dice, es que nosotros lo pusimos. Eh, pregunta y él respondió mi respuesta. Él tiene mi respuesta uh, eh, y yo tengo la respuesta de él. La respuesta de él fue he went to the beach barra salada y la mía ya no me acuerdo. Él tiene la mía. Ok. Por, por lo menos, bueno, voy a, pegamos algo. Voy a decirle uh, para Matías, what did, Matías, um, Ay, no, ahí sí me perdí, creo que la regamos. <risa> Matías, went to the visit. No, 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 no. Oh, went no se compliquen, don't complicate yourself, ¿ok? Us Matías, que le haga la pregunta y usted conteste con su real information, con su información ah, real. Right, right. Ok. Go ahead, Matías. Uh, where did you go on the vacation? Um, I, I went, I went to Barra Salada. To the beach. Ah, okay. sorry. Uh -huh. To the beach. Uh, and me, I visit my I visited? grandmother. I visiting. I I, visited? I, I, I I did I see, but I did visit. No, I visited or I visited. I visited. Okay, I visited my uh, grandmother and my old son. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, guys, thank you for participating in the activity. Um, 
while I was check monitoring the break rooms, I could see that some of you have some like confusions or yeah, I would say that like oh, you were a little bit confused about the use of uh, the qu information question. Okay, so just for you. <laughs> I'm sorry. Nothing teacher, continue please. Okay. For example, we have here the past simple WH questions. Como son information questions, eso significa que la respuesta no es un yes I did, ni un, all, ni un no I didn't, because those are yes no questions. But the one we are learning today is WH or information questions. Entonces, como está preguntando, está pidiendo información, la respuesta va a ser un, eh, va, no va a ser información. Corta. Va a ser información, correcto. Por ejemplo, ¿qué compraste? Compré un paquete de vacaciones. ¿A dónde volaste? Vol ¿A dónde voló él? ¿O a dónde fue? Él voló a otro país. When did we pay for the service? ¿Cuándo pagamos por el servicio? We pay for the service last month. How did they find out that it promotion? They find out about it on the internet. Okay? Entonces, la respuesta va a ser información, que puede ser una, una action, eh, ajá, um, information, right? About a place, about activities we did, etc. Todos yes. los verbos están en pasado, ¿verdad, teacher? Ahí no hay verbos en, 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 en base, base form. ¿En cuál, Matías? En las, en las preguntas con W question. No, mire, mire, ve. tenemos question word, auxiliar did, subject and verb in base form. El verbo en su forma base. Vaya, vale, miren, cuando usamos auxiliares, verbos auxiliares como did, cuando usamos el did para hacer una pregunta o para decir algo en negativo, el verbo siempre, 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 siempre va a ir en su forma base. Porque el auxiliar está haciendo que el verbo se vuelva pasado. Vaya, vale, muy bien. Ahora, chicos, creo que no vamos a tener suficiente tiempo para hacer role play. ¿verdad? In a role play, you have to tell a partner a call you had, pretend the customer was very angry because of a service, and you tell your partner all the questions you asked to find a solution. Pero creo que we don't have enough. No, no, no hay chance. <laughs> Matías. <laughs> the next class. Okay. Pero sí me gustaría que pudiéramos hacer esta actividad, miren, porque creo que okay. esta es la práctica que ustedes necesitan ahorita. Okay. Perdón. Yes. Sorry. Let's go. Okay, go. nice, nice. The wrap up. Vaya, miren, les voy a dar yo aquí una actividad. Por ejemplo, aquí tengo. I saw a movie. I read a magazine. I cleaned my apartment. I ate at a restaurant. I went to a park. I swam in the ocean. I did some exercise. I studied for an English test, I fixed my car, I went shopping at a mall, I found my friend, I cooked dinner, I got a haircut, I washed my clothes, and I played a video game. So you, I'm going to give you one of these. For example, I saw a movie. ¿Qué va a ser usted? But you are going to create five more questions about that statement. For example, I saw a movie. Okay, which movie did you see? When did you see it? Uh, who did you see it with? Where did you see it? Why did you see that movie? So, ustedes me van a hacer esas preguntas a mí. Por ejemplo, yo le voy a decir, hey, guys, I saw a movie. Okay, teacher, which movie did you see? Mm, I saw the movie Toy Story 4. Okay, when did you see it? I saw it last weekend. Who did you see it with? I saw the movie with my little niece. Where did you see it? I saw the movie in my mother's house. Okay, why did you see that movie? Well, because I wanted to relax and I wanted to see something funny with my little niece. 
¿ok? De, ese es un ejemplo, pero si por ejemplo tienen I read a magazine o I read a magazine, usted va a preguntar qué tipo de revista leyó, cuándo, por qué, dónde, etcétera, 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 ¿ok? Entonces ustedes van a hacer más, pre, más preguntas para indagar más about that, to investigate more, ¿ok? Ok. Y al mismo tiempo pues van okay. a ir practicando, entonces les voy a dar uno cada uno. Vamos a ver. I read a magazine. Esa se la voy a dar a, hmm, a Marcos. ¿Ok? I cleaned my apartment. Eh, Alba. I ate at a restaurant. Eh, Salvador. I went to a park. Eh, Matías. I swam in the ocean. Rocío. I did some exercise. Alfredo. I studied for an English test. Carlos Walberto. I fixed my car. Eh, Mr. Cañengues. I went shopping at a mall. ¿Quiénes me faltan? Díganme nombres. Me, me. Ah, Melanie. Okay, Melanie, I went shopping at a mall. Oh, what is that? Okay, I found my friend. Fatima, teacher. Missing. Okay, Fatima, I found my friend. Um, I took dinner Domingo, okay? ¿Quién más? Who else? Mauricio. Mauricio, I got a haircut. Me corté el cabello, que era haircut. ¿Quién es más? Who else? Teacher. Yes, Mr. Cañengues. Only, only question. Only question. Solo preguntas y no respuestas, ¿verdad? Yeah, only the questions. But if you want to practice more, Perdón, chicos, ¿hay alguien que tiene? Yo no, yo no, el mío no. William, William, I washed my clothes, William. Ok, hagan la, la pregunta, pero sí quizás mejor hagan la respuesta también porque vi que tenían problemas al responder. Entonces sí, question and answer, question and answer, ok? Please, Mr. Okay. Cañín, guessing everybody. Uh -huh. Tengo una duda, ¿verdad? Que en el ejemplo, la primera pregunta donde dice, which movie did you see? Está, está mal, mal este, escrita según la, la, la fórmula. Que 
Can you repeat, please? Con respecto a la, pre, a la primer pregunta del ejemplo, donde dice, which movie did you see? Así está, está bien correcto, según la, la, la fórmula que tenemos de, which did you, which did you small see? Es que which lo usamos para cuando hay opciones, ¿verdad? Which movie did you see? Sí, está correcto. Usa, this is the question, the question word. Y como es este, cuando usted, cuando usamos el which, hay op options. We have options. For example, which type of music do you like? Which movie did you see? Which color? Eh, which color did you use? Uh -huh. Entonces, como queremos preguntar cuál de todos. Y luego el did, el sujeto y el verbo. Teacher, uh, my question, uh, where did you to the park? But la pregunta es, I went to a park. No, uh, el mío es, I went to the park. Uh -huh. Entonces, ¿por ¿qué preguntas? O sea, no necesariamente tienes que usar las Ya mismas, voy en la cuatro. Entonces... Las mismas question words, puede, en vez de where, puede poner, how did you get there? Ok, ya, ya, es que eso quería saber si, si era necesario las cinco que usted había puesto ahí. No, Pero ahí pueden cambiarlo, ok, you can change. Ok, ok. Teacher. Tell me. Uh, the parts of the bear need is needed. Yes, need, needed. Uh -huh. With W, E. Need, yes, N-E-E-D-E-D. -E -E -D. Okay, thanks. You're welcome. If you are finished, guys, if you want, you can share your questions in the chat. Mm, only one. Oh, what kind of exercise did you do? Excellent. Mr. Rodas. How long did you exercise? Who did you exercise with? Where did you exercise the last time? And why did you exercise? Oh, nice. I'm going to answer your questions, Mr. Rodas. I did some physical and aerobics. aerobics. I did some aerobics, okay? I exercised them for 20 minutes. 
I exercised alone and at, I did it at home. Why? Because I need to, I need to lose some weight. Me too. I need to lose some weight. You need to lose some weight too. <laughs> yes, I believe me, I am on a I am on a diet right now. And um, well, yesterday I went to the I went to the doctor and I have lost four pounds. I feel so happy because I lost four pounds. Yes, that is great. Vamos a ver, Domingo, who did who cooked the dinner? ¿Cuál le toca a usted, Domingo? I cook dinner. Vaya. Podría hacer esto, mire, podría decir, who did you cook for? ¿Para quién cocinó? No, who did you cook? How did you, who did you cook for? And you can say, I cooked for my girlfriend. Cociné para mi novia. I cooked for my girlfriend. Where did you, where did go haircut? Mauricio, le falta el sujeto. Where did you get your haircut. ¿A dónde se cortó el pelo? Matías, very good. How long were you in the park? I listened to a strange yeah, one. And the answer. Supongo. Matías, how long were you in the park? I was in the park. Yeah. Uh -huh. pongo, no. For about an hour. Yeah. I spent three hours playing. <laughs> what is that? I'll touch in the cinco pongo de yellow. Ya las hice todas. Mm -hmm. no. Okay, somebody wrote, why did you fix your car? That's nice, pero no puedo ver quién escribió eso. Why did you go to the park? Okay, which... Uh, by Alba. Ahí puso cuál limpió el apartamento. Ahí sería who. ¿Quién limpió el apartamento? Se hace así, mire. Who cleaned the apartment. ¿Quién limpió el apartamento? Uh -huh. Cuando no tenemos aquí, no sabemos quién es el sujeto, entonces después de who va a ir el verbo en pasado directamente. Who cleaned the apartment? What kind did no sé Amircar que what kind of what qué tipo de qué qué tipo de refacciones o repuestos necesitaste ok what kind of mi vehículo? entonces sería así what kind of refactions did you need what kind of refactions did you need? Okay. ¿Y la respuesta? Yeah, it's okay. Marco, what did you read? I read the Coding Age Maintenance Magazine for Induce and Solar Machines. I read it in the last week and I found it very interesting. I recommend it. It's very informative. I went with my family. Okay. 
Vaya, Matías, who did you go to the park with? Ahí tiene que poner el with al, al, al final. Who did you go to the park with? Y sí, abajo puso, I went with, ah, me, me confundí con la tela. I went with my family. It's fine. The answer. Oh, okay. Very good. Okay, guys, it's time. Oh, Fatima, who did you help wash the clothes? Mm -hmm. Where did you call your friend? Why did you call him? Why did your friend tell you? Where did you know him? When did you visit your friend? How did you go to see her house? Very good, Fatima. Okay, guys, believe me or not, but we have come so far today. Uh, to the time of taking the attendance to finish the class. Imagínense qué barbaridad, qué rápido pasaron esas dos horas. Very fast, teacher. Y yo no la sentían rápido. Maybe. Okay, I'm going to ask the attendance. Okay. Okay, Alba Dinora Vides. Alfredo Cañé, Alfredo, perdón, Alfredo Alexander. <laughs> Alfredo Cañé. <laughs> 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 It's a teacher, present. No problem, no problem. I understand you. Yes, problem. Alicia Cañé. Amilcar Alfredo. Yeah, you don't have a, a middle name, so that will be good. <laughs> Alfredo Cañé. <laughs> Carlos Alberto. Present. Cristina. Okay. Present. Cristina no está, no estuvo hoy, ¿verdad? En la clase. Uh -huh. Vamos a ver, sí. Eh, Domingo González. Present. Fátima Portillo. Present. Matías Lemus. Present. Marco Velázquez. Present. Marlon Cardona. Mauricio Majano. Present. Maydeli Judith Díaz. Eh, Nancy Lisset Rodríguez. Nancy estuvo conectada como oyente, ¿verdad? Sí, iba, iba para la casa. Uh -huh. De ayer a las 7 okay. me fui para el trabajo. Rocío Maritza. Present. Salvador Escobar. Present, teacher. Sandra Velázquez. Víctor Salazar. En... No están, ¿verdad? Walter Daniel González. William Eduardo Pérez. Present. En Jasmine Melanie Lemos. Present, teacher. Okay, very good guys. I'm so happy that I saw you today in this class. I hope to see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Rest well. Don't forget to finish your homework. Good night. 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 It's your turn to stay. I don't know if you are available. If you can. Me, teacher. Yes, you. Okay. Okay, let's wait. I'm here. Nice. Are you working? I am working in a, a customer in San Salvador. Oh, you're near here. Oh, wow, nice. <laughs> wow. Uh, you look very nice with your helmet and your you. and your vest. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay, Rocio. Mm, do you have any questions about today's topic? Uh, no, teacher. I understand uh, the past simple. The I simple think. past. Okay. Yes. Can you ask me some inform yes, no questions and information questions in past? Uh, Did you uh, let me see. You can ask me about my childhood, about my last vacation, about my day. Why, 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 why did you study English? Okay, um, because when I was a kid, I liked English a lot when I was in school. And then when I was in high school, I got the opportunity to study English with a scholarship on una beca. So I okay. studied English for three years. When I finished my, my three year of studying English, I, I remember that I thought about um, what am I going to do with my life? Which career should I choose? And I remember that I liked to see my teacher, my English teacher, very happy all the time. So I said, I, I like that. I want that. And that's why I decided to study to become a teacher of English. Because okay, English and is... When did, you, when did you study for three years? When or where? Where? Oh, it was a it was a program called Superate. Oh. Mm -hmm. It was a. And you program. learn only in three years. Yes. I was very young. I was. Are you very intelligent? <laughs> I was. I mean, I used to go every day for two hours from Monday to Friday. And I was a teenager. I was 15 years old. That's why it was, I mean, I think it was easier because I was young. I was younger. <laughs> In the university, you didn't study English. I did because I studied to become an English teacher. But uh, for my career, I needed before I mean, to one of the requirements of my career was to have an advanced level of English, intermediate or advanced level of English. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you, what did you study in the university? I studied chemical engineering in Universidad engineering. Salvador. Engineering, chemical engineering. That is a nice yes. career. How how long did you study? Six years. You studied for six years, okay. Yes. What was the most difficult thing in the university? What was the most difficult? Uh, huh? The most uh, difficult experience or the most difficult thing, the most difficult subject? I don't know, tell me what was the most difficult Sub subject thing. may be physical chemica and reacciones cinéticas maybe wow you're but you're very intelligent because you know physics physics is difficult for me i remember that was yes. really difficult physics <laughs> <laughs> yeah but well if you like it you can do it I like it, I think. <laughs> okay, and did you have, I mean, I have this question. How many women were in the in the groups in, as your classmates? Were there more men than women? I don't hear you, teacher. Repeat, please. Okay, in your career, in your, in your classroom, were there more women or were there more men 
Ah, more men. In, uh, in general, in, 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 in the area, only men, almost. Only men. How many women? You and two more. Uh, maybe 10, 10, 10, but 50 men. <laughs> wow. Yes, I know that not, not all women choose those type of careers okay but i'm glad to know yeah. that i have the privilege to have a student who is a chemical engineering <laughs> okay and um, now tell me about your childhood what tv programs did you watch when you were little I watched uh, Pica Piedra. The Flintstones. Okay, nice. Heidi. Oh. <laughs> uh, candy Candy. Hmm. Okay, Thank nice. Thank you. I I watched Nickelodeon. <laughs> I watch a lot of Nickelodeon like SpongeBob, eh, Rugrats, Bananas in Pajamas, mm, Hey Arnold, Ken and Kale. <laughs> but also I watch the films, <laughs> El Chavo del Ocho. En el jardín de la tía Bubu, on, Saturday, on Sunday's morning. Yeah, those ones. Nice. <laughs> and what games did you play? What? What games did you play? Games. I played Sega. Pega. Sega. What is that? It, I don't it's understand. like PlayStation. Sega, uh, a blue, a blue uh, cartoon. A blue cartoon. Uh -huh. Sega. Ah, Sega. Ah, okay, video game. That is a video game. Uh -huh. Sega. Okay, yes. yes. Okay. Um, and other games, for example, I played the high and seek. That was my favorite game. Escondelero, high and seek. Ah, yes, also, yes. I play with my dolls, with my Barbies, and I remember that I played that I was a teacher and I had my teddy bears and my toys and my little sister, and I used a door as my whiteboard, as my board. <laughs> it was the kitchen's door. <laughs> I, I only had one Barbie. Only one Barbie? Why? Only one and, and only only one Roxana though. Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, or did you play with cars? No, only only those. Okay. Good. Did you play with your sisters or brothers? Or with your cousins or neighbors? With my with my second sister. Uh, she is the middle sister. Okay, so you played with your sister. Nice. <laughs> okay, Rocio, it was it was good to, to talk to you about this topic. And um wow, you're very responsible because even though you are at work. You are, you are in the class. Even though you are at work, you are in the class. You were in the class. So congratulations for being a responsible student. Okay, teacher. Don't Thank forget you. to complete homework number three because tomorrow is okay. our video conference number 15. That means that by tomorrow you need to have completed the homework number three, okay? Okay, teacher. Have a good night and take care. Bye.
Bye, teacher. See you tomorrow.